Hey guys, I hope you are having a great day wherever you are. Today we're going to be staying in a boutique hotel with over 200 years of history. We'll be trying out some of the local specialties and explore the town of Nakagawa Machi located in Tochigi Prefecture. Alright guys, we've arrived at our destination. Our journey today began at Ueno Station. We took a 40 minute Shinkansen ride from Ueno to Utsunomiya. Then we transferred to the Tohoku line to Ujie Station. Finally, we took the local bus to Minamimachi bus stop. It took us approximately two and a half hours to get here. Today, we're gonna to be staying at this boutique hotel with over 200 years of history. I'm just really excited to be spending a couple of nights here and just relax. Okay, here, it's just 30 seconds from a bus stop and it's so beautiful. So this is the main entrance. Dozo, Satoshi-san. This is insane. Look at this, it's a mansion. Guys, this entire area is ours for the night. Yeah. This is the Hontaku room, which is the main building. Main building, the house. Yep, there are six rooms in all, in total, for this boutique hotel. Look at this amazing Japanese garden. You got a nice seating area. You have like a little water thing there. In that warehouse, there are two rooms. Oh, it's a warehouse. It's an old warehouse. Old warehouse. Kura. So, so these are very old buildings with over 200 year history. Used to belong to the Izuka family. And now it's been renovated into a boutique hotel. So this is our room. Look. What shall I say? These stones. These stones takes you to our living room over there. This is our sitting area. Maybe we can have breakfast tomorrow morning here. That's good. Wouldn't that be nice? Breakfast? <laughs> You're so chill already. <laughs> By the way, that's the main street right outside. These fences here. Yeah, and this is where we checked in. We checked into that building there. And this is the sliding doors into our living room. Okay, ready to go inside? Yep. Hi. So, doza. Let's go. So, it says Hontaku. Hi. Doza. Hi. Arigato gozaimasu. So nice. I love this corridor. <laughs> Walking through the corridor. So glamorous. Our bedroom's on this side to the right. Wow. Got him. Got Look at it. this. This is like so... I don't know, I feel so spoiled being in this room. Look at this. You can see the scarring from our room. I love this. Me too. This is... This is we just sit here, we can sit here with some tea and just yeah. look out here, you know? Here is a living room. <laughs> the living room. The living room. I love In this lamp. Beautiful this design. And look at this lamp. I love it. Love, love, love. The Italian design. Italian design. Really nice big sofa. Mm -hmm. It's and like a bed. <laughs> it's like a bed. There's a little desk here. Here is the dining room and kitchen. So nice. Look at this. Oh, here. We have some sweets from the Morikawaya sweet shop, Ayu Monaka. It's like my dream kitchen. Can we check out the kitchen really yep. quickly? Mm -hmm. So there is an IH cooking heater. You can cook everything. Right. It's cooking tools. Right. Here's silverware. You got like frying pan, you got bowls, aluminum foil, wrap, measuring cup, strainer, you even got like condiments here. Look, mm -hmm. you got like soy sauce, pepper, salt, tonkatsu sauce, spatula, oh, uh, the rice paddle, rice paddle, wine opener, chopsticks. chopsticks. Okay, right? And you got a uh, dishwasher here. So you don't have to wash by yourself. Right. Oh, oh teacup. Yeah, coffee cups, teacups. Beautiful. This one is called the Koi Sagoyaki. Mm -hmm. The regional, the local uh, ceramic. Yeah, I definitely want to go to the store to check these out. And then here we have plates and 
bowls and glasses. Glasses. You can just live here, really. Yeah. You got yes. a sink. So this is tea. Green tea. This is coffee. Mm -hmm. This is all local tea and local coffee. This is uh, a uh, Japanese style kocha, Japanese style black tea. Mm -hmm. Your coffee maker. You got your tea. You got your kettle. And you have a rice cooker. Rice cooker. Yeah. Rice cooker. What a nice rice cooker. Wow. Yeah. Like you have a nice microwave mm -hmm. oven here. Mm -hmm. Ta da! Whoa. Whoa! What is that? Vegetable Welcome plate. plate. Welcome vegetable plate. Hey, look, there's a little thing here. Message. Welcome to Nakagawa Machi. Ah, it tells you what all the vegetables are, oh. where they come from, what farm they come from. Soda, milk, local milk, nasu milk, nasu farm milk, and orange juice, 100%. And this one is spring water. Spring water from the spring, which I think we're going to visit mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, after this room tour. Here's the bathroom. Very modern. I love the gold walls. I really do. And then you got your, your, you know, all your buttons. You even have a washing machine. This is a washing machine. Is this also a dryer? Yeah, it is. Yep. Washing and drying. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, very convenient for like longer stays. Mm -hmm. And you got your sink with all your amenities. You got your toothbrush, brush. Um, everything here. You really don't need anything. Ah, your bath towels, hand towels. You got your hair dryer. You, and this is your, what is this? It's a detergent. Detergent, detergent for your clothes. Very nice. And then, finally, not finally, this is the bathroom. What a very beautiful modern bathroom. I love this bathtub. You have a little window here that looks out into oh. like an inner garden. That's Momiji out there. It's pretty. Okay, finally the bedroom. It's so beautiful. What do you guys think? Don't you think this room is just amazing? So this is a Japanese style bedroom. I have to say this is very traditional yet modern. Modern. Modern style. It's traditional slash modern. I love it. And that was the room tour of the Hontaku room of Izukate. It's stunning. I am blown away by this room. I really am. This one is called Ayumonaka. It's a welcome snack. Japanese confectionery that's shaped like Ayu. Ayu, a kind of fish. Inside is Anko. Anko. Mm -hmm. mm. There's more Anko in the tail. <laughs> I love bunaka. <laughs> mm, me too. Mm. Have, have it with some tea. Mm. So we're just sitting here relaxing, enjoying the atmosphere, the tea and the ayu monaka. And we're going to be served dinner at 7 o'clock in our room. Uh, we're going to be served some local specialties. Really looking forward to it. Hi everyone, I'm Natalie. I'm the concierge here at Izukate. Izukate is the residence of the Izuka family. Well, they were in this area for 200 years or more. They were the village headmen of the area. So very rich uh, family, very important. They opened up a bank here and mayor of the town. And they also had a construction company. So the construction of their house was really strong. So it's still remaining now. The buildings now belong to Nakagawamachi. They have been registered as a tangible cultural heritage property, which is really great for the town and for Japan to keep this kind of uh, place still alive and preserve it for everyone to see for the future. Nakagawamachi is a population of 1,600,000 people. 
栃木県の北東部に位置する小さな町ですこの町の中には自然いっぱいあふれた自然の恵みたくさんのお米やお野菜がたくさん美味しいものがございますぜひ中川町に皆さんお越しください Okay, so we're gonna go get some water from this well. This is Natalie's well. My well. <laughs> Your well, Natalie. <laughs> My well. <laughs> Your well. So show us how we do it. How do we get water from the well? I've never done this before. Well?、Mm -hmm. At the well? At the well. Well at the well. <laughs> well at the well. <laughs> Walk up to the well. <laughs> And, uh. I'd have a little wash. Okay. A nice little wash. s e e n s I just sanitize my hands. I don't use up the women's room to sanitize it. Remove mask.、Mm -hmm. And it's water. <laughs> And just drink the water. Wow. That's wild. It's well good. <laughs> well, it's well good? You did that so well. So this is like water from the mountain? Yep. Yes? Delicious. It's cold and delicious. Is it? Oh, you see? Very natural taste. So, this place is considered to be one of the beautiful villages in Japan. And I can see why. It really is beautiful. Lots of nature and just, just spectacular. Sorry. Are those rice terraces? Yep. Wow.、Oh. It's beautiful. So, we're here at Fujita Ceramics、uh, to check out some of the ceramics, of course, because I love ceramics. You really, really love pottery or ceramics? I do. Cer ceramics and pottery. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. Hello. 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 So, this particular ceramics is Koi Sago Yaki, particular to this area. And、uh, they're using the local dirt,、uh, which gives it this uh, uh, special color. They have so much. What am I going to do? No. Buy. What am I going to、Buy、do?、It. I wonder if they ship. Do they ship? Oh no, this is torture for me, guys. This is torture. What am I going to do? There's too many things I like here. I you would choose, choose that one? one? Really? That'll be great for your coffee. You drink coffee every day. And I think Shinichi likes this design. I do. But then I also like this one. You know, I don't usually like the, the shiny ones, but this one, I like the earthy colors.、Mm -hmm. And we also need to get some rice bowls. And this color is beautiful. Look at that. It's a reddish dirt. Yeah, yeah. This, this one looks like the one we use at the hotel. Yeah, yeah.、Mm. Uh oh. I think I'm in love with this one. Look at this rice bowl. Look at that. So, this is the dirt that they use. To make the ceramics, which gives it that, that distinctive color. ほんとですか,か本当です、まま、これはいこれは飴湯っていう釉薬ですね茶色っぽい飴色になりますへえまずこれ黒ですねこの釉薬をか
引っ張ってます下にね取って高台をきれいにしたら今度はこんな感じですこうあの筋が立ってるみたいになってるのはその後で筆かなんかに伸ばしていくんですかうまくバトンを持ち上げて、これを。この2つのコーヒーマッグ、私は今度は、私が4つのライスボールを見つけた。これは素晴らしいです。これは4つのライスボールを見つけた。これは素晴らしいです。これは素晴らしいです。これは素晴らしいです。これは素晴らしいです。どうもありがとうございました。ありがとうございました。ありがとうございました。ありがとうございました。ありがとうございました。すごーい。もう重箱だ。ありがとうございます。はい、right. let's see what the first layer contains。ただ、おお、this looks like it's the トラフグ、which is the local puffer fish。this is the puffer fish that lives in the onsen water、so that makes it naturally non-poisonous。so I think this is sashimi。that's the meat、the flesh、and I think this is the skin。here we have。Local trout carpaccio. That's a trout, and I think there are some vegetables in here as well. Okay, second layer. Ooh, look at that. So, that you see is ayu. This is the local、uh, freshwater fish, and ayu is in season. You got some boiled edamame soybeans. I think that's teriyaki chicken with some vegetables here. That is a pate made of、uh, the Local boar, I believe. Finally, we have the simmered local vegetables. I see shiitake mushrooms, carrot, fish cake, konnyaku, takenoko.、Um, I see、uh, tamagoyaki. We got some tempura. I believe this is、uh, saya endo mame, which is green beans and watercress tempura. We got some pickled vegetables, some steamed rice, and for dessert, we have konnyaku yuzu jelly. All right, so first I'm gonna try the torafugu, which is a specialty. It's puffer fish.、Um, I actually have not eaten puffer fish, so I'm gonna put it into the sauce along with the green onions and the, the grated daikon and the chili pepper. What an interesting texture! I was expecting the texture to be like maguro, for example. Completely different. It's a bit firmer flesh, very clean taste. I like it. So, I believe this is the skin of the puffer fish.、Mm -hmm. Kind of reminds me of cartilage. Once again, it's very fresh and clean tasting. Almost no flavor, to be honest with you. And let's try the local trout carpaccio. The radish is crunchy and crispy. The trout is not fishy at all whatsoever. So, second layer, the main one is ayu, freshwater fish, just in season. So, itadakimasu. It's a salt flavored ayu. It is clean taste and it's flaky.、Mm. And it's seasoned simply with salt. It's good, it's good. The salt matches. Nasu dori teriyaki, teriyaki chicken. Mm. Chicken meat umami flavor. Little bit ponzu like taste. It's juicy. Good. This one is a wild boar pate. It's pretty rare to eat boar. It's like a corned beef pork version.、Mm. Mm. I like this.、Mm. This one. Karinto. Hon moroko liori. Karinto. What does that mean? I don't know. Sweet soy sauce marinated fish, and outside is the coating with, coated with the sugary stuff. Also tasty. 
fish, but it's not fishy. Okay, last layer, we have nimono. So that's what we're gonna start off with, the nimono, simmered vegetables. I see the shiitake mushrooms. I would like to start off with the shiitake mushroom. Mmm, 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 mmm. Perfectly simmered in a subtly sweet soy sauce dashi sauce. I think this is local yuba, tofu I think, skin. I think so too. Mmm, mmm. That yuba has taken the flavor of the, the sauce. Very, very good. All right, this is koshi hikari rice, the local koshi hikari rice, which is a high quality rice. I'm just gonna eat it without anything. Mmm. Oh shit. It has a subtle sweetness to it. I can eat the rice just as is. There's two types of tempura. One is the green bean, the local green bean. Mmm, so crispy. That is fresh. Mmm, and not oily at all whatsoever. And this is watercress tempura. Watercress. Mmm. Mmm. Watercress is good when it's made into tempura. I do like watercress but made into tempura is nice too. This whole town is one hotel, and this, this hotel, this house, is one room of the hotel. The meals came from the town, catering service. Most of these ingredients are local, local harvest. In this area, konnyaku is very popular. It's a one of the specialty of this area. Yuzu is a local, local grown yuzu. Oh. Yeah, it's konyaku, so texture is different from zeri, regular zeri. Hmm. But the inside text inside my mouth, it's almost melted. I thought konyaku is more firmer, but this one is soft. Oh, and yuzu flavor is really refreshing. So every morning at Izukate, they bring your breakfast in your room. Yeah, you can enjoy breakfast in the comfort of your own room. We have Vegemite at this hotel. I think <laughs> that in itself makes this place very unique. We have the Japanese breakfast today. You can actually uh, request the uh, Western breakfast if that is more your thing. But let's open this up. Wow. Ah, oh, sugoi. Okay, so that's the first layer. That's onsen tamago. That's natto, which is fermented soybeans. That's yuba dofu, uh, which is tofu. I think there's some cherries, sakurambo. Oh my goodness, cherry. Yes, cherries. And then you have a little umeboshi in here. Okay, oh. so that's the first layer. And the green stuff is wasabi, by the way. Look at that. Sakunanbo yeah, First cherry of the season. Yeah, it's very early. Yes, yeah, very early. And then the second layer, we have some kimpira gobo, which is a uh, gourd and uh, carrots. And this is sauteed. That is some tsukemono, that's cabbage and radish, that's uh, wakame seaweed with some ginger. Uh, what is this? Some green vegetables and some shirasu uh, fish. That's boiled fish. Then the final layer is the salmon with some daikon radish grated. And you got some, I think, ham underneath here. I think this is the local ham. And then you have your umeboshi, of course, you know. Oh my god, this, look at, 
look, you can pick it up with your hand because it's it's actually kind of dry. It's been pickled for 10 years. Amazing. Itadakimasu. Miso soup first. Oishii. Mmm. Mm, it's very gentle miso soup. The miso flavor is really mild. Shiitake mushroom, thinly sliced shiitake mushroom, local rice. Mmm. 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 You know, after three bites, the sweetness came from this rice. Yeah, it's very sweet rice. It's not sugary sweet. It's good rice sweetness. I love onsen tamago. Sometimes I make at home. Mm. I love this. I love this texture. Mm. Salmon. I love salmon. Grilled salmon. Lightly salted. Mm. And with good, good salmon taste. My mom used to always make Japanese breakfast, you know, before we went to school. Simple Japanese breakfast. Okay, I think I would like to try the tofu, the yuba tofu. Yuba is tofu skin, tofu is tofu. So maybe it is made with yuba. The tofu is made with yuba. Interesting, mm. isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's not your typical tofu. No, it's like cream. It's like a block of cream that tastes like soybeans, if you can imagine. That's amazing. It kind of just melts in your mouth. Mmm, the local ham. Mmm, it's so tender. It's delicious. Mmm. It is different from the ham that we buy at the supermarket. Gotta try this 10 year old umeboshi. Oh, it's so sour. It's like lemon. Oh, but you know what? Wakes you up in the morning. Oh, I'll eat with some rice. <laughs> sour. <laughs> it's like lemon, mm. right? like a very sour lemon. Mm. I imagine it's 10 years, 10 years umeboshi, so it is salty, but it's not salty. It's, it's not salty. It's more sour. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there is one thing that I'd like to try. Vegemite. A little bit on rice. Oh my gosh, that's Vegemite. It does look like uh, nori no tsukudai. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's veg Vegemite on the rice. Thank you, Natalie. Thank J you. Just to let you guys know, Vegemite's usually not on the menu. <laughs> mm. Is it good? Mm, mm, mm. Really? Please use very less. I put too much. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's it's not bad? Not bad. I really? love this umami. Really? Oh my god, mm. you're, you're putting more Vegemite on your <laughs> rice. Mmm. Mmm. Oishi. Mmm. It's like a soy sauce. Interesting. So that was our very short trip to Nakagawa Machi and Izukate. We stayed at this amazing place for two nights and we got to try many of their local specialties including yuba, rice bowls, a visit to a mango and coffee farm and a local brewery as well as the most amazing dessert we've had this year. We even got to experience making our own soba noodles. Those videos are coming up real soon so stay tuned. Thank you to Natalie and Kawanishi-san of Izukate for their hospitality and the kindness of everyone we met in the village. We cannot wait to come back. Thanks for watching. Please smash that like button and let us know your thought below. Information about the hotel is listed in the description. See you guys on our next video. Bye!